Hello random viewers, it's Pixel Luigi, and today I am back with more Portal 2. So I'm going to be continuing where I left off at the beginning of chapter 2. So if you didn't watch the last episode for some reason, we had just woken up GLaDOS, Wheatley had been knocked out, and we've been sent into GLaDOS's test chambers. And we have the double portal gun now. Alright. Okay, something weird is going on. Okay. I don't understand. What do we have to do? Is there a button? Oh! Never mind the lasers. What even is that? Whoa! Oh, it's, oh, it's a laser. Jeez. That thing loaded slowly. Alright, so that happens and then a platform appears. I think we're supposed to be standing on the platform when that happens. Oh, I thought the water was the toxic stuff. There we go. Not bad. I forgot how good you are at this. You should pace yourself though. We have a lot of tests to do. Oh no. If we have a lot of tests to do, I would want to complete it quickly. Yeah. Alright. It's still, as I like to call it, apocalyptic aperture. Alright. Well, on to more laser tests. This next test involves discouragement redirection cubes. I just finished building them before you had your, well, episode. Oh. So now we'll both get to see how they work. There should be one in the corner. Where in the- oh. <gasps> it's Wheatley! What was he- why didn't he say anything? Oh. Laser cube. Wheatley was there, but he didn't even say anything. What was up with that? Whoa. Come on. Let me- let me get out of there. Alright, there. Now I'm out. Okay, so this laser- this cube lets us redirect where the laser goes. That's actually kind of sick. Alright, then it creates the stairway so we can get up. Oh. Oh wait, we can just portal it over here. Yeah. So they act as both well done. weighted cubes and results. laser redirection cubes. You are a horrible person. Yay. That's what it says. A horrible person. We weren't even testing for that. Wow. I'm pretty sure GLaDOS is just making that up. <laughs> <sighs> All right. Don't let that horrible person thing discourage you. Okay. It's just a data point. If it makes you feel any better, science has now validated your birth mother's decision to abandon you on a doorstep. Oh. So, she was been by her parents, that's nice. Wow, what great parents this character has. I mean, that might just be a lie, because you can't trust GLaDOS. Uh, make the jump. Oh, I would have made it anyway. Alright, got that going. Oh, I gotta use portals on this laser. Uh. Congratulations. Not on the test. Ooh. Most people emerge from suspension terribly undernourished. I want to congratulate you on beating the odds and somehow managing to pack on a few pounds. Wow. <laughs> so we gained more weight. That's nice. I don't know. I don't really see how that's something to be congratulated for. <laughs> Oh wait, there's a new video thing. One moment. What? You are navigating these test chambers faster than I can build them. So feel free to slow down and 
Do whatever it is you do when you're not destroying this facility. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Jeez, we really are getting it fast. Okay, where's the cube? It looks like it's over there. Oh. Where is it? Up. Oh. Oh, it's just a weighted companion cube. No, this isn't a companion cube, it's just a cube. Wait a minute. Are we even supposed to be- Oh, great, of course the cameras are activated now. Alright, um... Uh, are we supposed to do something with these? Oh! Oh wait, move the cube out of the way. No! Protect the cube from the deadly lasers. Oh, it- Oh, the cube blocks the lasers. Oh, the platform only goes there. Mm, ow. Okay, looks like we gotta go back over there first. And then get it moving. Alright, so I gotta shoot that... There. That'll get it moving again, right? Oh yeah, it's going. Uh, just make the jump. Ugh. Oh man, we gotta make this jump. Whoa. I'll give you credit. Ooh. I guess you are listening to me. But for the record, you don't have to go that slowly. <laughs> Waddle over to the elevator and we'll continue the testing. Jeez, this place really is a mess. <laughs> stuff dropping in this stuff dropping all over the elevator shafts. <laughs> oh. Yeah. And on we continue. Oh. <laughs> Wall of companion cubes and turns. This next test involves the Aperture Science Aerial Faceplate. Oh! It was part of an initiative to investigate how well test subjects could solve problems when they were catapulted into space. Wow. Results were highly informative. They could not. Ooh. Good luck. Right. Oh, I love these. I love these aerial faith plates. They're so sick. Oh wait, we just gotta jump over here now. Oh, I love. I love. It's just like there's like a little music cue whenever you start going into Here's the air. You hear that? Fact. You're not breathing real air. It's too expensive to pump this far down. We just take carbon dioxide out of a room, freshen it up a little, and pump it back in. So you'll be breathing the same room full of air for the rest of your life. Hmm. I thought that was interesting. Oh, so there's like a little music cue whenever you jump in the air. You guys hear that? Huh. Well, must not be going since we completed the test, but there's like a little music thing. Oh, and the deeper we go, the more fixed it gets. Wow. Oh wait. Oh, the aperture logo was all clean now, so that means the facility must be fixed. Let's Told see you. what the New next test screen. is. Oh, advanced aerial faith plates. Ooh. Well, have fun soaring through the air without a care in the world. I have to go to the wing that was made entirely of glass and pick up fifteen acres of broken glass oh. by myself. Wow. Alright, this is where this is gonna get it fun. Oh boy. Oh my god, I actually did it! Oh my god! I didn't think I was gonna be able to do it! Oh my god, I love doing stuff like that! Oh, sorry. I'm still cleaning out the test chambers. So sometimes there's still trash in them. Oh. Standing around, smelling and being useless. Wow. Try to avoid the garbage hurtling towards you. Oh, and there's a turret hurling towards me. That's gonna help. You don't have to test with the garbage. No, I missed the it's ball. Garbage. Press the button again. Dang it. I missed the ball. Well, I mean, we got a completely useless chair. 
Alright. Um, oh, there's a cube coming this time, not a ball. Right, I think we gotta stand back a little more. Oh, here it comes. And... Oh, it just hit me. Alright, uh, we gotta do that. Is there any- Oh! Oh, we gotta take a different way. Oh yeah, we gotta just take a different way to get over there. Alright, there's a little teleport, teleport spot there. Do you think that the balances on the portal gun were good? Oh wait, I don't think we're, suppo we're supposed to be the ones who go this way. I think it's only the cube. Great, okay. Um, I guess I just gotta do an orange portal. There. Oh yeah, just take me back here. So... Oh, I think I know how we gotta do this. So we gotta put one portal there. Then we gotta put another portal there. So that when we bring out the cube. Oh, wait, I think I should put the blue one a little higher up. So that hopefully the cube will fly in this direction and land on the button. I'm hoping that will happen. Okay, looks like it needs to be a little more to the side. Maybe that'll work. More to the side. Maybe I should just try, like, right there. That might work. Oh yeah, now you can hear the background music from the- Okay. Too- Too much to the- Too much in that direction. Alright, let's try this way now. Um, How's it going? I, when I first played the campaign in this game, I had a little trouble figuring this one out, too. Alright, perfect. Remember before when I was talking about smelly garbage standing around being useless? That was a metaphor. I was actually talking about you. Oh, thanks. And I'm sorry. You didn't react at the time, so I was worried it sailed right over your head. <laughs> which would have made this apology seem insane. That's why I had to call you garbage a second time just now. <laughs> Stating the obvious here. It's not really that... Like, it's kind of annoying. <laughs> Did you know that people with guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noises? <laughs> wow. I'm sorry. I don't know why that went off. Anyway, just an interesting science fact. <laughs> oh, did I accidentally fizzle that before you could complete no. the test? No! I'm sorry. Go ahead and grab another one. Ah, I want to catch a mid -air. Nice. Alright, so... Uh, you have to just oh, no. I fizzled that one too. Stop it! Oh well. We have warehouses full of the things. Huh. Absolutely worthless. I'm happy to get rid of them. Wow. Alright, I think I know how this is gonna work. Yes. Wait, do we have to carry it up with us? Uh, of course we gotta carry it up with us. Um, alright, maybe I should just support that here, and then drop it down into the orange portal. Oh wow, that actually worked. Okay, now I think we gotta jump down. Whoa! Alright, I'm gonna put that there. Yay, then a platform opens up. <sighs> then we just gotta use the same jumping technique. Whoa! And there we go. Every test chamber is equipped with an emancipation grill at its exit, so that test subjects cannot smuggle test objects out of the test area. Okay. This one is broken. Don't take anything with you. No wait, we gotta go back and take the companion cube! It'll trigger GLaDOS! Um... Where's the companion cube? Is there any way we can portal it back? Oh my god. Oh my god, I want to bring the companion cube with me. We gotta bring it with us! Here, come on with me, little buddy! Don't worry, I'm gonna get you out of here! I mean, it's not like you really need my help, but I just need a buddy, because Wheatley's gone. Alright, here we go. Let's see if this actually works. 
Oh my god. It actually works. We can actually bring the cube with us. Oh, dang it. I think that one was about to say, I love you. They are sentient, of course. We just have a lot of them. Hmm. I really wanted to take the cube with me. I mean, at least we got an achievement for that. <laughs> I never really tried to do that the first time I played. Yeah, that's, that's kind of cool though. All right, moving on. This next test involves emancipation grill. Yay! Remember, I told you about them in the last test area that did not have one. Oh, portals can't pass through them. Oh no, the turbines again. I have to go. Wait, this next test does require some explanation. Let me give you the fast version. <laughs> if you have any questions, just remember what I said in slow motion. Wow. Test on your own recognizance. I'll be right back. Very useful. I couldn't even understand what you were saying. What color is that? Okay, that's blue. Whoop. Alright. Can this thing let lasers go through it? Okay, lasers can go through the emancipation grills. Alright, there. Whoop. Moving on. Hopefully Klaus <laughs> fixed up the chambers. Or the pipes or whatever. Oh. Alright. Moving on. Alright, well, we finished chapter two. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Portal 2, and I will see you next time. I'll be playing chapter three, The Return. Alright, bye. Oh, don't forget to follow my Twitch, subscribe, like, it'll help with my channel, and follow my Instagram, Pixel Luigi Live, or my Facebook, which has the same name. Alright, actual goodbyes now.